When a source of sound moves in relation to a listener, the pitch or frequency of the sound changes. For example, as a locomotive whistle approaches a stationary listener, sound waves in front of the train's whistle are crowded together and follow each other at a higher frequency, producing an increasingly higher pitched sound. As the locomotive whistle moves away from the listener, the sound waves are drawn out to longer wavelengths at a lower frequency, producing a lower pitched sound. This phenomenon is known as the Doppler effect, and it applies to all types of waves. Move the train toward the listener and the whistle rises in pitch. Move the train away from the listener and the whistle lowers in pitch. Scientists use the Doppler effect to measure star movement. The star's light changes wavelength as it moves toward or away from Earth. Compare the light spectrum emitted from a star that is stationary with respect to Earth to the spectrum of a star that is approaching Earth. The star's light shifts to shorter wavelengths of light in the blue end of the spectrum to the spectrum of a star that is receding from Earth. The star's light shifts to longer wavelengths of light in the red end of the spectrum. An aircraft's speed and motion can be calculated by measuring the Doppler shift in frequency that a radio wave emitted from a point on Earth undergoes when it is reflected from a moving aircraft. As the aircraft approaches the observation point, the radio waves have higher frequencies. As the aircraft recedes from the observation point on Earth, the radio waves have longer frequencies.